Welcome Sagittarius. This is your reading for June 2024. <laughs> so we're starting mid June, but so your your uh, month's already been going on. So we're going to see a little further about what the rest of the month is holding for you. So let's check this out. And again, before we begin, I'm going to ask that we're surrounded by pure white light. And I'm going to ask to have your higher self come forth today to give you the information that you need to hear for your highest good and the highest good of everyone else concerned. So let's see what's going on for you for the rest of the month of June. Well, happiness, <laughs> I'll just end it right there. <laughs> That's awesome. We'll see what's going on. I guess uh, if you were having a little bumps in the road beginning of June, the happiness card comes up. So that's awesome yes actually so if there did have bumps in the road literally um if there was anything medical that happened this month or uh you're feeling like things were broken this is talking about bringing back the happiness okay so this is either healing um, um as far as something that's physical um feeling better about it um we'll see why that's that's great <laughs> congratulations See what's going on. Yes. Now, if there was a relationship issue that had some uh, brokenness to it, okay, this is talking about um, either bringing in somebody new or mending this relationship, okay? Um, it also can be, you know, a love or two doesn't necessarily have to be a relationship wise. It can just be about you um, loving yourself again, being happy again, bringing up the light. You know, if you've been depressed, maybe this is about you actually feeling good about yourself this this June. So I like that. So this is, again, if it was something at the beginning of the month you were feeling down or depressed or something, this is about your light is coming back mid-June, rest of the month. And we'll see. Yeah, so threaten card comes up. So it may have been the beginning of month. You may have been feeling just not optimistic. Let's see why this comes up. Yeah. Um, and also maybe you were, uh, either afraid to reach out or make that call to somebody or, um, maybe you wanted to try to make another call and it didn't happen. Let me just see. Yeah, this is okay. So. This card comes up, which is, it doesn't mean death. It, it means um, it's the end, okay? So if, if you were um, planning to finally end this relationship, okay, it's feeling like you, you know, being complete, ending it is bringing back your happiness and bringing back new light in a relationship, okay? It feels like um, the decision that you made in the long run is bringing you happiness that it's time to kind of end any unhealthy relationships um and and it doesn't have to be just a relationship in as regards romantically it can be relationships as far as friendships sometimes we have people who are just not um good for us mentally um they may drag you down and this is about letting things go this month okay um it also can be even about um unemployment Maybe, you know, the work has been um, making you feel physically ill and you've decided, you know, I can't do this anymore. It's not good for my health. It's really making me sick. And I'm going to, you know, call up and say I'm, I'm done unless this changes. So this is a really powerful month for you, really. It's about um, almost sticking up for yourself and creating a life you want. And it, so it's talking about a great summer for you once you... Uh, Mm -hmm. wisdom for sure so this is about having the wisdom to go ahead and move forward let things go powerful very powerful june for you and i love this too because this is the wisdom to finally be satisfied it's about not putting up with i want to say bullshit basically things that aren't healthy and this is about finding your happiness and creating it this month so it may have been hard in the beginning of the month but the outcome is really good um let's see I love your cards. They're really blunt. Yeah. See, this is the wisdom, too, to not create these disasters in your life anymore. This is about really going, uh-uh, my life is more important. I'm not going to have this chaos around me anymore, and I'm done. Okay? So this, congratulations. I know it's hard sometimes to deal with that, but this is being satisfied, and this is being happy. Okay? So, you know, uh, 
the expression dark days are over well it's time that you end the dark days over here okay so you end anything that you feel threatened by anything that doesn't feel right this is putting an end to it okay um and again um you always want to make sure that you do things for your highest good okay and the highest good of everyone else concerned you know sometimes being in a bad relationship is not good for the other person too even though you feel you know they're doing something to you it's not good for them either because it's not healthy that they keep on perpetuating what they're doing um and they need to get some help so remember take care of you first um this month it looks like you're going to be wise and satisfied so let me know comment and like and if it's the first time you're watching please subscribe thank you so much for watching have a great june it's going to be interesting for sure thank you